A little March Madness style bracket pitting high school girls against each other based on looks. Has many in one town in central Ohio a bit upset? NBC4's Matt Edwards was told the school knows who created the bracket. He joins us now from Granville with the latest. I spoke with multiple female Granville High School students earlier this evening, and they all echoed a similar sentiment. Regardless of whether or not this bracket was meant to be malicious, its consequences have been far from pleasant. As spring arrives in Granville, it's joined by a debate, which is sparked by a bracket created by a Granville High School student. It's cyberbullying, and in an, to an extent, it's sexual harassment because it's objectifying women. Allison Gill Kibler is a senior at Granville. She says the debate amongst the bracket creates emotionally impactful conversations. One of the girls she was asking me about was standing there with tears in her eyes, and that's really when it hit for me that. This isn't just a game or, you know, a joke about girls. It actually can impact them significantly. On your social media, you need to delete it. If you save the image, delete it. That's Granville principal Matt Durst addressing the school earlier this week. He told me off camera the school is doing all it can to make sure the teenage students understand the impact these actions can have. Just all the normal stresses of adolescence, we don't need objectification on top of that because once we start thinking we're less than other people it hurts our confidence and lessens our chances of being successful. I was also told by multiple current students that this bracket is not the first of its kind but they are hoping it will be the last. In Granville tonight, Matt Edwards, NBC4.